Field Air Force Base serves as the Air Force's premier high-altitude reconnaissance team. And as such, the base delivers globally integrated intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance, or ISR, in support of national objectives. On Wednesday, March 11th, Team Bill welcomes six media outlets onto the base. I think it's important to bring the media in to basically inform and educate the public on um, how we provide high altitude ISR to national decision makers. At the end of the, the day, we're the eyes and the ears for the nation, and so I think it's important to kind of showcase that to the public. During their time on Bill, they looked at the many aspects that come into play when conducting high altitude ISR, visiting a variety of facilities and aircraft, both past and present. While there, they not only got to taste some of the tube food that pilots eat, but more importantly, they had the chance to interview both wing leadership and airmen from across the base. I think my favorite part of the tour was probably the uh, space suits, the flight suits that they wear. Um, how they have to deal with the environments at the high altitude was pretty fascinating. To be able to see uh, the detail and the precision that goes into the suits and to see how rigid they become when they're inflated was pretty fascinating. I also thought the film, wet film processing was really interesting. It's interesting to see such an old technology still in use today and providing great results. With this experience, it gives us an opportunity to explain to friends and family what it is that we do with, uh, without having to worry about crossing any lines as far as classifications and things of that nature. It also gives them a chance to come in and see what we do, and we can put out our information to them so that they understand that when we're staying late, we're working long hours, we're, you know, their loved ones and spouses aren't there with them, that they are actually doing something that means has a strong purpose and a strong meaning. This was the first media day that the base has hosted in a number of years and Wing Leadership looks forward to opening its doors once again in the near future. Reporting from Beale Air Force Base, California, I'm Tech Sergeant Tony Plyler.